In the past 15 years, we have been studying the matter present in the first moments of the universe by colliding lead ions together at the Large Hadron Collider. We learn a lot, especially about this quark-gluon plasma in one of the most extreme states of matter formed in the universe, which we can produce as well here at CERN. But the question remains, when does it appear? At which point do we start forming this plasma? We don't see it when colliding tiny protons, but we do when the much larger lead ions. You can think of this like a pot of water being slowly brought to boil. It's definitely liquid at one point, and it's definitely steam at another point. But when does this transition? How does it do so? A few years ago, we tried with xenon, about a quarter of the size of the lead, and managed to produce the quark-gluon plasma. This year, for the first time ever at the LHC, we went even smaller with oxygen and neon, about 16 times bigger than the protons and 1 13th or 1 20th the size of the lead. We recorded billions of events over the summer. It's been super intense time. And with the effort of the whole collaboration, we managed to go from conducting the experiment to the physics results in just six weeks. During the studies of the light ion systems, we have performed many measurements. For instance, we looked at how particles were distributed in the collisions. We also looked at how they move collectively. If there's a plasma presence, they will move together like a boat pushed by a wave. If there isn't, they will move much more freely. We call this flow. And lastly, we have also studied how the production of particles changes compared to proton-proton collisions to see if there are any new phenomena that are distinctly different. Essentially, we count the particles produced in the proton-proton collisions versus how many are produced in oxygen-oxygen and neon-neon collisions. This difference, we call it the nuclear modification factor. Our studies are far from over, so stay tuned for more results in the future from the CMS collaboration.